implement the following expression. Again, like always, we are going to start to see how many pairs of brackets we have. We have one pair, and this is the second pair. So we are going to have two parts of the circle. And like always, we are going to start drawing the circuit from implementing the expressions which are inside of the parentheses, inside of the brackets. Now, I'm going to start from this parenthesis. This is three input and gate. I have three input and gate. With input A, B naught, so that's why I have inverter, and I have C. I finished with the first parenthesis. This gate is OR with exclusive OR gate. So I have exclusive OR gate, which has inputs A and D naught. That's why I have inverter, because I have D naught. Now, these two expressions are NORD together. NORD because this is the OR sign, and because I have bar over these two expressions, that's why I have to NORD them together. Okay? Now, these parentheses are NORD with C naught. Okay? Why? Because I recognize whatever is inside of this parenthesis as a one term and C naught as a other term. So that's why this sign is going to be influenced by this bar. Okay? So that's why I'm going to have C naught. I have inverter over here. And I'm going to have NOR over here. Now, we're finished with the very first part of the problem. Let's check second part. This is nothing else just the three input NOR gate. I have A and I have B and I have C naught. Okay? Now, take a look. What we have over here? We have C naught also over here. When I don't suppose to use two inverters. Okay, so what I can do over here, I can erase one of them. Okay, because this one was first, I can erase this one. Okay, and simply connect output of this inverter to the input of my NOR gate. And this is going to give me also C0 because C0 is going to be over here. And this C naught will go to the NOR gate. <coughs> now, my three input NOR gate is exclusively OR with AND gate. That's why I'm going to draw the AND gate with inputs C, C, and again I have B naught. I have B naught already over here, okay? I don't supposed to use another inverter. Another inverter is going to cost me extra space, extra power, okay? So I don't need extra costs, okay? That's why I'm going to take 
the jumper wire and connect my end gate to this inverter and I'm going to get B0 from here and send also to this gate okay and we said that this gate is going to be exclusively OR exclusively OR with this NOR gate okay this is exclusive OR and everything has to be OR together. Okay? Now, let's take a look what we obtain. Let's prove that whatever we have done is correct. Now, on the output of this gate, I'm going to have A B not C. At the output of this gate, I'm going to have A exclusive or D not. At the output of this gate, I'm going to have A B not C nor with a exclusive or D not okay and I have to have bar over here and I'm going to close this inside of the parentheses okay on the output of this gate I'm going to have A B not C I simply copy everything whatever comes to this input Node with A exclusive or D node. Okay, and I said this is north with C node because C node is going to go over here. Okay, this is what I have got at the output of this gate. At the output of this gate, I'm going to have A nor B nor C nor okay because this is three input nor gate at the output of this gate I'm going to have C and B not this B not comes from here now at the output of this gate I'm going to have simply whatever I have on the first input exclusively or with whatever comes to the second input. That's why this is going to be A nor B nor C not exclusively or with C B not. Okay. Now let's write the final answer okay we can add also parentheses over here now final answer is going to be basically everything whatever comes to the first input of this OR gate and whatever comes to the second input of this OR gate that's why this is going to be a b not c or a exclusive or D node and everything is node and node with C node okay and everything is or with whatever comes to the second input so this is or and I have nor gate A nor B nor C not 
exclusively odd with C B naught. Okay? And this is the solution. Okay, so we can say that my output function is exactly the same like the function which I start with. Okay, so it means that my circuit is correct.